I'm going to be working as a farmer here in Brookhaven today. And what I'm going to be doing, I think I'm going to be trying to sell some apples. Because I got a lot of apples in my barn right here. We got a lot of apples in these boxes right here. I got from my apple trees. I don't really have like a field like usual farms have. But I do got a couple of trees on my property. So apples is my main thing that I'm going to be selling today. And hopefully we'll actually be able to get some customers. Because I really, really want to try to make some money out of this. So yeah, it's definitely going to be an interesting one. And anyways, let's go ahead and pack up some boxes boxes into my truck and maybe even drive around and see if we can be able to sell some apples. Alrighty, I got a box right here. Let's go ahead and put that into the back of my truck. Boom, just like that. And we can load up some more boxes. And yo, is somebody pulling up to my farm right here? Okay, let's go ahead and have a chat with this dude. Is he lost or something? Because nobody's usually pulling up to my farm like this. Hello there, sir. How's it going? How's it going, my man? That is a really cool truck. Yeah, thank you so much, dude. I appreciate it. It is a really cool truck. But anyways, can I help you, sir? Are you lost or anything? Anything like that because I'm just a simple farmer, bro. Yeah, do you have anything for sale? Well, I do sell apples if that might interest you. <laughs> dude, I'm not really sure if this dude is actually interested in buying apples, but yeah, I'm at least selling apples. That sounds great. All right, well, how many apples do you want to buy, sir? I got a lot of apples up in my bar right there, and I was just about to load up some boxes into my truck. Huh, a hundred. Whoa, okay, you want a hundred apples? Well, I'm not really sure if that will fit on that little bike you got there, sir. You will have to need a huge truck like mine to actually carry like a hundred apples. Yeah, it won't fit. Yeah, do you need my help to transport the apples? I can help you out, sir. Well, I do got a huge truck right here, so why not put it to use, right? Yeah, can you transport them to Eagles View? Sure can do, buddy. I can transport the apples over to Eagles View, but it will cost you $200, though. It's not for free, and it's not really cheap, dude, because now I actually gotta transport them all by myself. Okay, sounds good. Alrighty, well, let's go ahead and get in the truck and transport the apples over to Eagle View. I'm not going to charge him before before we have actually arrived over to Eagles View. And whoa, dude, am I getting a new customer? What is she up to, man? I think she might be lost. All right, then let's go ahead and back into the truck and head over to Eagles View. And my truck actually got turbo stage one, so it's kind of kind of fast, actually. I'm not sure if this dude will be able to uh, catch up. Yeah, bro. Yeah, my truck is super fast, bro. Holy mama! Oh, man, I just crashed a little. Hopefully, I didn't ruin the apples, bro. <laughs> Okay, anyways, let's gonna pull up to Eagle's View and try not to crash into his house because that would have been terrible. Oh, man. I just kind of jumped a little bit there. There we go. Okay, we're at Eagle's View. Let's gonna grab a crate of apples and yeah, hand it over to him. Oh, dude, you want it up to your door? Okay, okay. Let's gonna go in here and where do you want me to drop it, sir? What? Oh, he wanted to put it into the fridge. Okay, let's gonna drop it into the fridge. Boom, just like that. Alrighty, sir. Well, what price did we agree upon? I kind of forgot, dude. Did I say $200 or what? 200 bucks. Oh, okay, okay. Got the money up. Nice. There we go. We have grabbed the money. And yeah, it seems like it's actually $200. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you, sir. You, you have a good one. You have a good one, my man. Okay, so there we go. We were just able to sell 200 apples. No, 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 wait. <laughs> I was able to sell 100 apples, which is not bad at all. And we made $200. So yeah, not too bad, not too bad. And what we can do, we still got some crates in the back. And maybe we'll be able to sell some apples to some random people here in Brookhaven. Because I'm a farmer, bro. I gotta make my money. Money. And it seems like we do got a couple of people in the street right here. So yeah, let's go ahead and ask them. Hey guys, do you maybe want to buy some apples? I'm selling apples out of my truck right here. And yeah, they're freshly picked. I picked them today and boxed them in. And bro, this is kind of creeping me out, dude. They look the same, man. And they're just staring at my truck like that. And yeah, I'm not really sure what's going on. Anyways, let's go ahead and head over to these guys. Maybe these guys want to buy some apples. Hello there, guys. Do you maybe want to buy apples? I'm selling apples today. And it seems like nobody wants to buy apples. Apples. Oh, man. Maybe we can go ahead and head over to some houses and see if they maybe want to buy some apples. Because, you know, when the apples are actually delivered to your door, maybe it's easier to just accept it and, yeah, take the offer. So, yeah, let's go ahead over here. Boom, just like that. We do got a house right here and we do got a guy here. And uh, let's go ahead and ask him if we want to buy some apples. Sir, what are you doing, bro? Why are you just sitting in my truck like that? Bro, dude, get out of my truck, dude. What you doing, man? I'm just trying to sell you apples. Oh, 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 oh. Is he trying to steal my truck? Did I lock my truck, dude? Yeah, okay. I actually remember to lock my truck this time. And I'm not really sure why he's sitting in my truck. Maybe he wants a show. Let's go to give him a show. Maybe he will give me money that way. Okay, there we go. Let's go to jump on this jump right here. Boom, dude. Yay. <laughs> Bro, I just think you want to jump around a little. Okay, I was going to jump on this jump as well. Boom, just like that. Whoa, man, we almost flipped over there. Okay, that was kind of dangerous. I should probably relax a little bit. But yeah, let's going to hit this jump as well. Boom, 
Welcome, dude. Whoa, man. Okay, that is literally insane. And yeah, where should I go right now? We can go ahead and hit another jump. It seems like he's having a great time. Ah, man, no, bro. I flipped the truck. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Okay, there we go. And uh, let's go and bring him back to where his house is at. Uh, yeah, it's enough show for today, bro. Hopefully, we'll actually pay for this show, though. There we go. Let's go and bring him back to his house. Boom, just like that. Okay, that will be $100 for the show, my man. That was not a free show. And hopefully, you had a great time and will actually pay me my money. And, dude, is he not going to be paying me my money, bro? Oh, man. Okay, maybe we need to rob his house then. Because, yeah, he kind of owes me money now. All right, yeah. Well, let's go and jump into his property then. And, oh, dude, he just opened a door for me. Okay, well, let's gonna go in here then. I want my money back, sir. Oh, he's going after me now. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. He's going to be going after me. <laughs> okay, there we go. Here is his safe. Where's his safe? Where's his safe? Oh, it should be up here. should be up here. Let's go and blow it up. Boom, just like that. We got the money. We got the money. We got the money. Let's go and grab the money. Now we gotta get out of here. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. And we're out, dude. Ha, ha. I got my money. I got my money. Okay, now we gotta get out of here. Oh, look at that, dude. I think he's angry at me. Bro, he's just staring at his house. That's what you get when you don't pay for the show, my man. I literally took you on to so many cool jumps. And yeah, you were not going to be paying me? Like, what is going on here? Anyways, let's go ahead out and about and see if we will be able to sell some more apples. Because that's what I'm actually doing today. I'm not trying to be robbing houses and stuff like that. I'm just trying to sell apples. Okay, here we go. We do got plenty of people right here. Maybe they want to buy some apples from me. Hello there, guys. I sell apples out of my truck. Do you maybe want to buy some apples? Apples, they're freshly picked today. Um, okay, sure. Okay, let's go and give her a apple. Boom, just like that. How much? One dollar. It will be one dollar for the apples, guys. And let's go and give her an apple. Boom, just like that. Okay. Oh, does she want an apple as well, dude? Okay, let's go and give her an apple. Boom, just like that. Okay, so there we go. It seems like I was just able to sell three apples. I really do appreciate it. Thanks. Okay, boom, just like that. I think I just got three bucks. I gave everyone an apple. And yeah, everyone seems to be happy. Oh, dude, that's the guy I just robbed, man. Oh, man, oh, man. He's trying to steal my truck again, bro. What are you doing, bro? Come on. Don't eat him. Ew. What? What's going on, dude? What? Dude, what? Bro, there's nothing wrong with the apples, bro. Yeah, bro, they're freshly picked, dude. They came right from my apple trees. Um, I don't feel well. Get away from here. Dude, those apples are fresh, dude. I literally just picked them today. There's nothing wrong with the apples, bro. Oh, man, what are those guys doing? Are they trying to get, like, insurance money now? <laughs> dude, I have no clue what's going on. Okay, well, anyways, let's go and try to sell some more apples here in Brookhaven. Uh, can we really find some people, though? Oh, dude, those guys are still just standing there, bro. What's going on, man? Maybe they want to buy some apples now. Yo, guys, do maybe want to buy some apples? I'm selling apples, though. Oh, they're actually moving now? Okay, they're not just standing still anymore. And then they're moving now. Oh, dude, this is kind of creepy, man. No! Okay, fair. So they don't want to buy the apples. Okay, well, well, well good for you, though. Uh, the apples are really, really good. Okay, anyways, let's go and see if we might find any other customers here in Brookhaven. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Bro, are there literally no houses in this street? anymore. No, dude, I think the guy I robbed, he removed his house. Oh, man, he got that angry? And it seems like now we got a snowstorm here in Brookhaven, so I should probably actually get home, because yeah, driving this truck in the snow, uh, well, it's kind of slippery, dude, so I don't really want to, like, crash. Let's go ahead back to the good old farm and relax a little, because I did make my money today. How much money did I make today? Like, $203, which is not bad at all, so let's go and park the truck inside of the barn just so the snow doesn't ruin it. And we can go ahead and basically just chill out in the jacuzzi, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go to chill out in the jacuzzi. We gotta turn it on, though. Boom, just like that. And we can have the color green. And we can just go to lay here and relax and eat my fresh and tasty apples. So there we go, guys. That was a pretty successful day as a farmer here in Brookhaven. And if you think Brookhaven should add, like, a tractor in Brookhaven, make sure to hit the like on this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.